Hey, this is Ted with Schrader Tree Farm. Um, today I'm going to talk about setting up straw bales or hay bales for gardening. Um, so I've been doing a lot of reading on this. Our soil out here is pretty sandy and that's why it's perfect for Christmas trees. But to plant garden, it's pretty tough. So what I've read is you can use straw bales, add some blood meal, and that will cause the straw to start to decompose and basically make a compost. So we're gonna do that, but you have to set up your hay bales by adding one cup. I made myself a little measuring thing. I took a red solo cup, measured a, a cup of water in here. And uh, I'm gonna use this as my scooper. You're gonna scoop this into your hay bale, sprinkle it around, and then you're gonna soak this thing with water. Basically, you're, your blood meal is adding uh, nitrogen to your straw. That's gonna start your, um, your compost and uh, get that started. And then as we go along, you're supposed to do that for like 10 to 14 days. You take a temperature reading of the inside of the straw to see uh, how warm it is. So you can tell if it's starting to decompose. So I got this at my local hardware. Made my little one cup measure. And uh, I'm gonna try one cup. I've read all kinds of different amounts you're supposed to add to the straw. But as you can tell, you need to get where your bale, the straw is running up and down. So they've strapped it around the side. So I've got the string going around the side of the bale. So I would say, um, just kind of look, you can see the ends in here are coming, poking up. So I'm gonna open up my blood meal and it is just like a black kind of dirt compound. I don't, kind of like charcoal almost. I'm just gonna measure out a cup. You gotta put a cup in each of these straw bales, so we've got about a cup. Just sprinkle it in there. I got three hay, uh, three strawberry seals, so I'm gonna put use three cups a day. I got a couple bags of this. We'll see if it's uh, enough to get us through. So the next step they say is to just soak these down until water starts running out of them. So I don't know how long it's going to take, but uh, I'll start doing that. The next few days it's supposed to rain, so I was hoping that I could kind of prep these before the rain, then just add the blood meal as it rains, and then the rain can take care of watering them every day for the next three or four days. So I'm starting to see water come out the bottom. So I'm gonna just give it just a little bit more. And then I'm gonna do the same thing tomorrow. I'm gonna add blood meal to each bale. And then um, water, if it's not raining. And I'm gonna do that for about 10 days. Probably on the seventh day, I'll check the inside temperature and see um, if we've got to, I think it needs to be to about 120. This is the first time we've tried this. I like to try new things, see how they work. So follow along and see how this turns out with us. Hey, if you'd like to see more videos like this, like and subscribe to Schrader Tree Farm. We'll see you in the next video.